What up, y'all? It's another vlog day with me. Fall in love with me. I introduce her to the game and let her thug with me. See me like Bunny and Clyde. She even clutch in me. I feel like it's do or die. She give her soul to me. She want to be close to me. Oh, she say she fuck with me the long way. She say she gon' run my back. I had a long day. She say, baby, I ain't gon' lead you down the wrong way. Okay, so... <clears throat> YouTube some hoes, right? They done fucked around after I paid y'all to see my intro. If you ain't seen my intro, that means you ain't seen my last video. I spent so much time making that in that introduction video and bought the music for it and everything. YouTube still copyrighted my shit. They for sure copyrighted my shit. So, yeah. I... Don't know why I ain't think about this shit at first. My brother, shout out to Trillian in one time, make music or whatever, called in the game, like a motherfucker. So I was like, man, let me hit my bro up and then just put some of his music in there and his beats. Like, why the fuck I ain't think about this shit at first? Girl, because what we not gonna do, uh, y'all not finna keep copyright claiming my shit. Like, bro, I paid for that shit. And you gonna fuck around and give me a copyright claim. Piss me off. Cause I'm like, damn, is it the intro or is it like the clip I used from, it was the Jada video. I'm like, is it the news clip? Then it was the motherfucking music in that 20 second ass video. And I definitely fucking uh, appeal that shit. <clears throat> but every time you do a goddamn YouTube appeal, they be like, no, nah, appeal denied. All right, motherfucker. Shit. So I was mad about that shit. Cause I really spent a long time on that fucking shit. But luckily it's saved. All I gotta do is switch the music out. Are y'all turning left? But nevertheless, the motherfucking concert today. The motherfucking Anaya Lamise concert is today. Ah! Y'all know how, if you don't know me, you don't know me for real because I am an Anaya Lamise super fan. I, I am she. I am she. That's all I listen to. I, I don't listen to nothing else. Anaya Lamise, LMA, sometimes uh, SZA, because I like the Control album. <clears throat> what else? Nipsey Hussle. That's pretty much it. I keep the motherfuckers in rotation or some old school R&B. And then on top of that, they're going to have Life, K702. I think Young Jock is the motherfucking uh, host or some shit. I just give a fuck about Anaya Lamise. Like, I love the rest of them, don't get me wrong. Uh, that's my shit. But, I get to see Anaya Lamise in concert. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I just woke up like an hour and a half ago, and I ain't really got my energy yet. So, I'm about to run to, y'all know I got to go to Starbucks, duh. But, I'm also finna run to Ross because I got hella outfits in the motherfucking closet hella goddamn outfits with the tags on them and I still want to go see if I can find something else because what I want I don't have in my closet I want some motherfucking jean short overalls so bad and I know Ross ain't gonna have them but they gonna have some shorts though because I want a certain specific pair of shorts because my shorts they look too big all my shorts are a little too big or they they look too small and so, I don't want to put no belt on. I just want to be able to slide them bitches on. I want a little crop top. And I really want to wear some tennis shoes. Like, I, uh, I want to wear some tennis shoes so bad. But if I wear tennis shoes, the outfit got to be cold as fuck. I just really want to wear some tennis shoes. I don't want to wear no damn uh, sandals or whatever they call them shits. I, it's just, uh, it's not giving me. It's not, I don't like sandals. It's too girly. And they be flat. I don't be comfortable. I can't move in that shit. It just be too much. I just want to put some tennis shoes on. So I'm going to attempt to find me something where I can wear some motherfucking tennis shoes. Now how I'm going to do it, I don't know. But I got a shit ton of pair at home. I really want to wear my Harachis. I need to go to the shoe shop, man. I want some more tennis shoes. It's some Jordans I want, too. Yeah, I just gave up on sandals. I don't even think I have, like, a decent pair in my motherfucking closet. 
I need some motherfucking samples because I don't even think I got a decent pair. That's how much I hate them hoes. Is this a front sweat and rose? Is God this good? Oh, and it is. And it is right by the door. Yes. Oh, my God. I love it. So, yeah, I get to ride with me real quick while I run these errands so I can get ready for this concert. Uh... But I'm not taking y'all in the store because I got to focus and it just be weird because y'all just be sitting there watching me shop. Then I can't talk. Motherfuckers think you be recording them. I ain't got time for all that shit. So I will be right back. Okay, it's hotter than motherfucking Panther Pussy out here. Like, oh my God. Damn, even my glass is hot. Oh. That line was so goddamn long. Girl. This trifling. This is this is pure trifling right here. This is damn. You need to do your motherfucking eyebrows, bruh. What time? Look, I need to get my eyebrows done real quick. I just don't know how long it's gonna take. It's two o'clock. I have got to be at Stephanie's house by five, sir. Can you get from behind me? And I just ordered me some Starbucks too. I think I'm gonna go. Come on! I don't just like just anybody doing my shit though. Oh, bro. Y'all gonna let a nigga back up? Y'all know y'all want this spot? You want this spot, don't you? Yeah, you do. That's what I thought, nigga. This good old foreign spot. You know you want this spot. It's hot, y'all. It's so hot, like it's hot, hot, like real hot. Like, what's the 98 hot? But it feel like 105 in this bitch. And I ain't got on no, uh, I mean, I'm gonna put on my seatbelt, but I ain't, I just look a mess right now because fucking for what do I need to get dressed up for right now? Because I definitely gotta like take a shower and shit. Come on, bitch. Ah, I missed the light. Uh-uh, 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 the devil is a liar. He is a liar. I am not letting you go. You can go the other way. <sighs> Y'all. And I don't know what this face breaking out. When I, did I tell y'all? Did I, I can't remember if I showed y'all when my eczema went away. Like, completely, like, hand softening a baby's ass. Like, literally, the shit went away right after I took that fucking medicine. I don't know who been stressing me out. Okay, well, I'm lying. I was a little stressed because um, TTM was applying for a grant, going through a whole grant process. Shout out to Collective Action for you. So I had to prepare for that. It was a two-day presentation, Q&A type deal, community thing. But nevertheless, we won $15,000, bitch. Yes! Yes! My baby won! We won 15K, boy. I'm so excited. That is the biggest grant TTM has received in six years. Six years. Six years my baby been working hard, okay? That is the biggest. We have gotten so many multiple small grants, but 15K is definitely the biggest one we ever got. For sure the biggest one we ever got. Like, I'm so excited. So, my eczema started breaking out because my eczema is triggered by stress. So, now you can see, like, it's a little, it's starting to get a little brown up in that cuticle area. Yeah. Yeah, I'm stressed. You can see it in my face. My face break out real bad when I'm stressed. Stress just messes my body all the way up. And it's like, I don't even be feeling stress. Like, it's just that my body know I'm under stress. But this is shit that I always do. Like, I'm always on the move. I'm always doing business shit. I'm always moving fast. So, to me, I be stressed, but stress is so normal to me that I don't even be noticing until my body start breaking down and be like, bitch, we stressed because this is what we ain't got time for. We need you to sit the fuck down. We need you to chill. Because... <laughs> 
You don't want to chill? Okay, fine. So we finna just start breaking out. We finna start breaking out is what's gonna happen. Um, it's time for me to officially put a color on my nails. Yep. I, I knew I was only gonna like this for about a good week. So, my baby won 15K though. And the grant is for us to help youth entrepreneurs create or start their revenue generating business. I'm excited because I already got two of my babies that I've already helped them start their uh, business. Shout out to Sincere. Y'all know Sincere. That's the only person I let touch my hair, okay? Y'all create fake collections. This is not new. I'm not new to this. I'm true to this. How many times I got to get y'all the plug? I wish, like, everybody was in Houston so that my baby can really do their hair and, like, y'all can get y'all shit done right. But if you are definitely um hit her up or hit me up and i'll plug you in um because i don't let nobody else touch my hair when it come to braids twists uh oh, that or my sister i'll let my sister do it but other than that because mm -mm. mm -mm. yeah mm -mm. um hold on gotta check my phone because y'all know my shit get hot um and beyond the lash co my baby kendallin who does lashes Okay, I don't I don't get with the lashes. I don't do the lashes. I might do lashes for Cancun. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I'm probably gonna get cat lashes for Cancun. That's gonna be the first time I ever like legit got my lashes done. We'll see. We'll see. Uh okay, so I need to go back and watch the other video. I don't like this. I don't I don't like this right here. This I don't like this. Okay, I went to go get my eyebrows done. I'm very picky about my eyebrows. I only let certain people do them. I didn't feel like going to the nail shop I normally go to. Like, because I go to one for my, my nails and my eyebrows. It's, it's a whole bunch of different shit going on, okay? Normally, I let the lady who do my real hair do my eyebrows. She in Missouri City and require appointments. This is a last-minute decision. That's where that pimple was. Um, I just saw this. This, this here breakage, this, this part right here that's that part i don't like that part now i ain't got no ends on my eyebrows so that's that's me that's all me that's not her um i let them grow in thick and don't get them done often because i like my eyebrows thick i need to my face is breaking out very terribly but yeah this mm -mm, i don't like that i don't like that but the fucked up part about it is I think I always had that and she just made it more noticeable. I don't know if she fucked it up or if my eyebrow fucked up, but either way I'm pissed. I think she fucked it up. I ain't never seen no space like that in my eyebrow. It's noticeable. It looked like a V and I don't appreciate that. Fuck, I'm gonna have to fix it. I'm Baby, let me tell you how I'm about to try to fix this eyebrow. Girl. Girl. Listen. So, girl, look at your face. I'm about to attempt to fix this eyebrow, and it was like a success fail. Like, I just, but I didn't give a fuck, because at that point, it was like, fuck it, and I was running late. So, why I fix that, I want y'all to tune into this music, okay? I want y'all to listen to this song. I want y'all to get into it, because I'm finna just go ahead and play this fire and it's by my brother Trillian. I will put his information in the description. So y'all go ahead and support a real nigga. Okay? While I try to fix this fucked up eyebrow. Look at me struggling. Look, look at the struggle. Look at the struggle. It came out all right, but... It, yeah. I was pissed. <laughs> Potential to be what I need to be for me. You got potential to be what I need to be for me. You got potential to be what I need you to be for me. I say you got potential to be what I need you to be for me. You don't really want nobody if it ain't me on your body. Yeah. What's the shit that you were talking? I wanna see your body right. You bag it up, I beat it up, it ain't no thinking about it I feel like Rocky, I get cocky if you tell me stop it You got potential, got potential, ain't no doubt about it 
I said you got potential to be what I need to so be for me Let's see where it lead, I'm taking it and I'm gon' do what I please Break your bed, how you like it, let you control the speed Throw it back just like you hiking, I might bite it, nigga, night it Then once you sleep, I'm gon' roll up the weed That pussy stretched out on the sheets, bed soaking wet, can't sleep in it Once I get hang on, I'm tryna sneak in it Wake up out of sleep, repeat the We start off with four, play, get the kiss, and then I lick it, get to switching positions. I got you pinned up in submission. I know I can talk to you and expect for you to listen. I feel close to you when we fall apart and distance. We to be why fuck it up. We got a vibe out of control. I know you feel it in your soul. Just stay down on this rock and roll. You got potential to be what I need to be for me. You got potential to be what I need to be for me You got potential to be what I need to be for me I say you got potential to be what I need to be for me You don't really want nobody If it ain't me on your body, yeah What's the shit that you were talking? I wanna see your body, right? You bag it up, I beat it up, it ain't no thinking about it I feel like Rocky, I get cocky if you tell me stop it You got potential, got potential, ain't no doubt about it I say you got potential to be what I need to be for me Telling me no, but when I seen the outfit in my head that looked like this with the Tupac shirt and the tennis shirt, I'm back up a little bit. When I saw it, it was like my body, my body telling me yes. I'm telling y'all, that's exactly what happened. Like I thought about the outfit, looked at the outfit, and my mind was like no, but my body was like yeah. <laughs> Anyway, I got y'all on the tripod, so I'm finna see if I can shake y'all asses up. Y'all in my house, as if y'all ain't never been all in my house. Now, I don't know how far I can bag up for y'all to see the hole. Yeah, that ain't gonna work. Okay. I'm gonna just push it down a little bit so y'all can see my shoes. I just got on some Air Maxes. <laughs> Stephanie! Hi! <laughs> I've been vlogging all day, so I was like, I gotta get Stephanie. We out to you. <laughs> we outside. <laughs> Indeed. Uh, Step aside. Yeah, no, nah, I couldn't. One, two with the wedge. I couldn't do the heels. I'm yeah, definitely giving. Right I'm too. definitely giving Stephanie's girlfriend. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm definitely giving Stephanie's son girlfriend right now. Uh -huh. I'm definitely giving, and that's cool. Oh, that means nobody talk to me. Nah, I'm definitely giving stuff a girl for <laughs> All right, it's time to go. Baby, so let me tell y'all the ghetto shit I did because I was being lazy. I barely got footage on my Instagram. I pretty much did a whole bunch of short clips. So I wasn't about to do all that. What I ended up doing was screen recording my story from Instagram so yeah that's what y'all see and y'all gonna accept it as is clearly young jock look like somebody uncle on this stage like sir 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 and then life jennings i kept calling him brother muhammad i ain't shit but yeah he definitely was up there doing his thing but i ain't gonna lie he kind of slipped a little bit without his instruments like I don't know. I wasn't really feeling it. Mm, it wasn't given. But, I mean, clearly I was singing. Like, I think he was singing S-E-X. Yep, I could tell by the way my lips is moving. Girl, fix your twist. Fix, fix the twist. Fix the twist. And then, what happened here? I don't, is this... Okay, this was Young Jock. I don't know what the fuck he was even singing at this point. Yeah, um, whatever. 
I don't fucking know. I don't remember. Honestly, I don't. I'm just tell y'all. I'm be honest right now. Um, what was going on here? Oh, okay. So here come Anaya Lamise, bitch. Hey, that's bae. That's bae. H time all day, bitch. I was so excited. I was sweating like a motherfucker, but I was excited in the beach. I was. My sis was giving, and I was real close to the stage. Got me a little high five and everything, because it really wasn't that many people there. So I was, like, right up on the stage, and I fucked with it. Like, that shit was dope as fuck. I almost got a picture, but I, like, didn't get one, because she got bombarded. So, yeah, that was a fail. But I was still close to shit, and I still had fun. And I still was lit. I was turned up. This was literally probably the only time I got up and just really danced. See, you could tell. Look at look at super fan. It's giving very much super fan. And of course, y'all know I had to mute this part and do a voiceover because what we not gonna do is get copyrighted. Hey, hold up. Look at look at look at. And she actually reposted my post on Instagram. I was pretty live about that shit too. But my neck, my back, lick my and my crack that's definitely what she was singing <laughs> that's definitely what was going on and shout out to my good sis stephanie for coming with me to the concert nevertheless we had fun it was a night to remember so love you stephanie so it's definitely officially 1 a.m in the morning and I am just getting to my friend Stephanie house because she drove to Humble. And I'm going back home because I'm sleepy. I'm tired as the fuck because it's way past my bedtime. I do not stay up this late. But it was worth it because um, I got to see a night of <laughs> And I was so close. I got me a high five and everything, bro. I was so mad the one time I wasn't recording. But that's all right, because I was there front and center. Okay, front and motherfucking center. Um, If I haven't already, I will insert a clip from the concert. But, of course, y'all know I got to cut the music off because I ain't got time for no copyrights. Okay, okay, no copyright going on. But, um, yep, 702. Life was up there, did his thing. Case did his thing. A couple of local artists. Now, only thing I'm pissed off about is uh, uh, the concert was supposed to start at 6 30, and it definitely started at 8 30, which is why I'm out this late. I was pissed. Like, bro, I paid $100 for these tickets each. <laughs> why is this concert starting three hours or two hours late i don't understand why is this happening so by the time they even started the show it was like a comedian it was a couple local artists it was 702 life went like by the time anaya lamise went it had to been like 10 something because it was her, then it was Case, and then we lived, like, in the middle of Case performance. But it, it had to be, like, 10-something by the time she even got on stage. And I was like, oh, my God, I just want to see Anaya. Like, once we see Anaya, we can leave. Like, everybody was pissed. The crowd was, like, saying shit. And then it was giving very much, like, wedding reception because it was a concert, but at the same time, it was, like, small so it i didn't know what to expect and then it was kind of like us but like had i known especially with the dj i would have brought my mom and them like i would have definitely got a table because it wasn't like a concert like i thought it was gonna be it was definitely giving way to reception definitely for sure giving way to reception from the people that was, I, i'm convinced i had to be the youngest person in there like i didn't see all the young people come out i don't know where they came from but i ain't see no young people come out until nyla meets got up there i kid y'all not like that was when I seen some young folks get up there. Like that's when all the, the chicks and stuff got up there. But I, sitting down, and I was in the front row because I had VIP seats. But sitting down, yeah, I ain't seen nothing but a bunch of uncles and aunties, mamas, daddies, grandpas, grandmas. That's all I saw. So I was like, oh shit, I could have brought my mama here. Like we could have did a whole little uh, get together with this. 
It wasn't no lines. It wasn't no walking. It wasn't none of that. But my life is complete because I saw my enemies and she was right there. We was like rapping and shit back and forth, making eye contact, and I got me a little high five. I tried to get a picture, but because she came out to like the dance floor when Case came on, and I tried to get a goddamn picture. But somebody grabbed her, like, right, like, this dude had stood right in front of me with his big ass, like, right when I was going to ask her. I was so mad, bro. I was like, man. And then she had, like, while, like, everybody was trying to get to her or whatever, so I couldn't. Like, I was literally right behind her about to tap. So I actually tapped her on the shoulder, but the dude, like, stood in front of me. I was like, motherfucker, is you serious? You just completely ruined my goddamn selfie. But it's cool, because she's going to be at my wedding, birthday, engagement, something, something. I don't know, but she's going to be there, so I'm not even tripping. It was fun. It was cool. <laughs> I'm definitely sleepy, y'all. I'm going to go home and take this makeup off my face, pull these eyelashes off, take a shower, and get in the motherfucking bed. Because I'm normally used to staying up at 2 in the morning, but... I be at home watching TV. I don't be out amongst the public. And then I don't go out that much anyway. So, that's already a thing. But, um, yeah, that was my day. That was concert day. That was vlog day. Get ready with me day. All of that. So, I will holla at y'all boys later in the next video. So, until next time, and I'm not finna cut the camera off, I'm just finna keep going and cut it later, cause I'm driving. But, until the next video, today was wonderful, tonight was wonderful. Bye!